We need to be able to summarize in the click of a button. Okay, okay, okay. I might have an idea. Spend the rest of the day on this. Sure, I'll get that to you by the end of the day. Great. If you want to create this dynamic chart, first go to the developer tab, then insert now the option button. Copy and rename these for each option you wish to have. Next, right click on any of these and choose format control. Create a cell link. Now when you click on one of these buttons, it will change the value in the link cell. Our data set has months starting at 10 for October and finishing at 12 for December. Let's make our cell link dynamic with a formula and adding 9 so we get 10 for October, 11 for November and 12 for December. Use the filter function to get a data subset. Choose the array, control shift right, control shift down. Set the filter criteria on the month number. Now we have a dynamic filtered data set. Next, select the data set and insert your chart. Let's do some quick formatting. Voila, a fully dynamic chart based on our radio buttons.